One day, God came to Abraham in a vision and said, Don't be afraid. I am your shield and your super duper reward. Look, you haven't given me any kids, answered Abraham. When I die, my servant Eliezer will get all my stuff. He won't be the one, answered God. You will have a child. Count the stars if you are able. This is how many descendants that you will have. Abraham believed God. Sarai had an idea for Abraham. Look, the Lord has held me back from having children, so I want you to take my Egyptian slave girl, Hagar, as your wife number two, and maybe I'll have children by her. Abraham listened to Sarai, and Hagar became pregnant. Hagar's attitude changed towards Sarai. She thought she was better than Sarai because she was pregnant. And this made Sarai very cranky. Sarai treated Hagar harshly and Hagar ran away into the wilderness. An angel found her by a spring of water and said, Go back and obey Sarai. You will have a son. Call him Ishmael. He will be a wild man, and he will want to fight against everyone, and everyone will want to fight against him. Hagar returned. Abraham was 86 years old when Ishmael was born. When Abraham was 99 years old, the Lord appeared to Abraham again and said, Now your name is Abraham, because I have made you a father of many nations. And call Sarai, Sarah, because I will bless her and give her a son, and she will be a mother of nations. One day, not long after, as Abraham was sitting in his tent in the hot part of the day, three men stood by him. It was the Lord. Oh, please, please come, come eat and drink and rest, begged Abraham. Abraham and Sarah brought fresh bread, butter, milk, and beef to the visitors. Sarah, your wife, will have a son, said the Lord. Sarah was listening in the tent, and she laughed. The Lord said to Abraham, Why did Sarah laugh? Is anything too hard for the Lord? At the appointed time, I will come, and Sarah will have a son. I, I didn't laugh, lied Sarah. No, but you did laugh, answered the Lord. Sure enough, one year later, when Abraham was 100 years old and Sarah was 90 years old, she gave birth to a baby boy who they named Isaac. Isaac means laughter. Abraham and Sarah were so happy. Lord, help me to be patient while I wait for your timing in my life. Help me to know when I should do something to fix my problems or when I should just let you work it out your way.